Magandang araw mga pre, mayong adlaw po sa mga bisaya diha. Guillermo El Chacal Rigondo, kilalang matinig at kilabot sa bantamweight division. Dating 2 division champion at 2 times Olympic gold medalist. May kasalukuyang professional record na 20 wins, 2 losses, 13 via knockout. Wala daw nakapagpatumba sa kanya sa amateur, pero noong pumasok siya sa professional boxing, ay nalasap niya ang unang knockdown mula sa kamao ng dating WBA Super Bantamweight Champion na tubong pa naman na si Ricardo Cordova. November 13, 2010 sa Amerika ang naging laban ng dalawa na para sa WBA Interim World Super Bantamweight title. May undefeated record pa dito si Rigondo na 6 wins, 0 loss, 5 dito via knockout. Habang 37 wins, 2 loses, 2 draws, 23 via KO naman si Cordova. Bagamat nanalo si Rigondo sa bakbakan, ay di ito naging madali dahil split decision ang resulta. Kaya ito ang unang laban ni Rigondo na talagang sumukat sa kanyang abilidad at tibay sa bakbakan. Sabay natin balikan ang laban na kung saan unang naranasan ni Guillermo Rigondo ang mabilangan dahil sa knockdown. Guillermo gives it a little Cuban flavor. He says it's Rigondeo, just as Max just uh, just pronounced. Seven, two and two, and he's ranked in the top. Uh, my amateur scout, my boxer Andy Lee, who told me that Parag was going to... Third Olympic gold medal, he would have joined Laszlo Papp. Be compared to them, and in fact, that, as you said, if he had entered the tournament, he would have won the gold medal. It seemed to be pretty obvious. His weight is evenly balanced. Cordova's, despite Cordova's back down drag out affair, in which I believe Cordova Cordova's and Juan Diaz and several others to South Poles. Every fight can be as awkward as that yes. fight. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Happening. Somebody to turn him. Ronnie Shields wants to turn him into a more aggressive. Yeah, but I, I'm very impressed with Rigondeau, regardless. I mean, his punch is. Well, so and Cordova. Fake was it the kind of fight that could leave a fighter? It was a, it was a real brutal fight. The fight of the year. This is not the fight of the night so far. This is not the impressed with him. He has tremendous. It's a power punch. Very few effective jabs. And it creates offense. Yes, it does. Jones, Floyd Mayweather. Those are two guys who more or less dispense. Ali, Sonny Liston. Yes. Round 4, unang nabilangan itong si Cordova. Pero tumayo at sinabayan pa rin si Rigondo. One is walking Cordova down. Three to nothing, Guillermo Rigondeo. And down Three. goes Cordova. Five. As the precise Six. shots Seven. of Rigondeo made to the right side was, of Cordova's body. But he Cordova was, is not recovered. Well, he, he was at a body. You know, I gotta say, and now he's, and, and Rigondeo recognizes it was uh, the, the right hand to the body. That's it's a pretty crisp puncher himself. Is it not? For Cordoba. Ten shots landing for Rigondeo, including, of course, the body shot that created. Then the one Harold Letterman showed you. Here you see the knockdown, which was a left to the body. The same left hand punch that he was shooting at the head. Well, that's the liver shot, and we've seen yeah. that many times before. You see a good body punch does create a delayed reaction. And ending the fight. Arturo Gatti did it to Leonard Doreen. Mickey Ward used yep. it. Cotto ultimately developed more variety in his game. Talking to Rigondeau yesterday, tape, and he said, and he shrugged it off like, not just a fighter. Right. If the guy can make me change during the fight in the ring, we can probably rest assured that in his, what, 250 closes. He's not used to that. And he has so much confidence in himself. The nature of amateur boxing, when you might, um, or the speed. Yeah, or the speed. Now goes wherever the money is. Wherever that division is, where he can get a payday is where he's going to go. he's going to be a So everything is uh, bouquets and flowers in... Uh, are told Freddie Roach, the trainer of Roach. Manny Pacquiao, will go there to watch Robert Garcia rapping, covering the events in Margarita's dressing room as we go along. Manny Shields might have said to him, Guillermo, you don't want to... Update to sa round 6. 
na bilangan sa unang pagkakataon si Rigondo. As a professional, it's very important. Rigondio's knee hit the canvas. Two. That's a knockdown. And it's going to be called a knockdown. Four. Makikitang tumiklop ang tuhod at natukod ang kanang kamao. Right hand. Perfect shot. And watch the glove touch the canvas. Almost. And he's never been knocked down as an amateur or a pro. Yep. So if so, that would be the wow. first time in nearly 300 fights that he's tasted the canvas. Yeah, the claim is that he's never been down in sparring, never been down in a fight, never been down, period. So you witnessed a little history. But I, I went through almost, I went through 300 fights. Which has taken place regarding that issue. Who would have expected anything else? Five rounds to one, 58-54, Guillermo Rigondi out. That's it. Much more confident in this punch and power. And this college could think that he could be thrown for a mental loop. Can I get an A for that? Absolutely. Let's see the results. And uh, uh, Shioka and these guys have the results. Now told if they was up like 12 to 4. You have to recognize now that the momentum of the fight is completely reversed. Where he wasn't landing anything a few rounds ago. Orlando Cuellar is a good cheerleader. Now, you don't need to cheerlead. And I wonder... Maybe it, it makes the hands a much more if they make it very clear. In this round, we're going... And now... Cordova's dictate turnaround began in round doing right now. He's not going to win a lot. But the computer doesn't work this way. There's a difference between boxing and running. And he's doing a little running here. Yes. That's landed. He's not going to keep that. Riggy on. Because of the few counters he landed early in the round. Yes. Thing because the turnaround is aggressive and stay aggressive. And guy who may be able to compete at the hot dance. Culturally, any tape anywhere on the. Uh, this is anybody watch round seven and eight. Do something. Just because you're trained by a particular guy. On the ring for two rounds with the kind of advantage six or seven or eight years ago. This level that um, other advantages his opponent might have. The booing of the crowd does affect some of the job completely, and it irritates the judges as. That means right. puncher's gloves. That's puncher's gloves, and it's normally in a 154 pound. And you know, Manny Pacquiao loves the Reyes glove. Fight, and therefore at 150. By setting up catchweight fights, they see. Although it shouldn't, it shouldn't be did the same thing. That's why this modern. 126 pound champion, 130 pound champion. As long as you don't use plaster pairs. What if a couple of judges watch the seventh and eighth rounds and. Tell you Joel Casamayor still hit ticket or sold pay-per-view hookup. He is going to go over there. Nagtapos ang laban sa score na 112 to 114 pabor kay Cordova. 114 to 112 at 117 to 109 pabor kay Rigondo. Panalo ang Cuban boxer by a split decision. To the winner by split decision, El Shaka Guillermo Ricando. Mild applause, some booze from the crowd. Shout out kay Albinjo Maravilla from Bicol, Camarinesor. DJ Clarin from Mati City. Camillo Amper from Hingoog City. Amping mo pre. Huwag kalimutang ilike ang ating video. At pakipindot na rin ang subscribe button kung ikaw ay bago para umabot na tayo sa 200,000 dito sa munting tahanan ko. Maraming salamat sa panonood at suporta mga pre. As always, Amping Permi.